My name is Jeroy Bryant, and I'm currently in the fourth grade at Conley Elementary. I want to be a teacher when I grow up. In order for that, I will have to block out the noise. I estimate that I have 12 years before I can reach that goal. I will have to go to middle school, high school, and college, not to mention all the life that will happen during my educational journey. I know I can be successful because of Ruby Bridges. She was the first African-American person to desegregate the all-white French elementary school of Louisiana in 1960. She was only six years old at the time. I cannot imagine how scared she was as she entered the hall, the school hall, the school and walked its halls. So many people were angry just because they didn't want her to be there. Somehow, through all that, she was able to block out the noise. I believe we, I believe we should focus on the things that are important to us. Too often, people focus on other people. The world would be a much better place if we could move forward and block out the noise like Ruby Bridges. Megger, Martin, and Malcolm. Shirley Chisholm said that she could be president. Jesse Jackson told us to keep hope alive, and we did. Proud, inspired, bold. Hi, my name is Tiana Potts, and I attend Conley Elementary School. I am in the fourth grade, and I want to be fearless, bold, and brave. Last December, I was the master of ceremonies at our school Christmas program. A teacher asked me out of the blue to host the event, and I took a leap of faith and said yes. I had never done anything like that, but I thought I could do it. School has given me an opportunity to stretch my comfort zone, and I look forward to taking risks to do that. Someone I look up to that was fearless, bold, and brave, had no comfort zone, is Harriet Tubman. Harriet Tubman was born into slavery in 1822. Somehow, she escaped in 1849. Not only did Harriet escape, she went back to those same slave plantations to rescue her family. She made about 13 missions to rescue at least 70 slaves. I don't think I could be that brave, but if I could be half as brave as her, I would be more than all right. I want to be a surgeon when I grow up. Like Harriet Tubman, I too want to, want to save lives. She showed me that a black woman can do can set, do, let me, do anything they set their mind to. There's a lot that I need to do to come close to reaching my goal, and I am up for the challenge. In the meantime, I will continue to seek out experiences not as dangerous as Harriet Tubman's that can feed my ambition to be fearless, bold, and brave. Thank you.